Welcome back. This is a Rotten Raven. Uh, this is we're doing 100% all achievement, but we're starting off with uh, getting on track like a pro. This is to build a locomotive within the first 90 minutes of the game. I'm also doing a slightly harder mode with another achievement of the Lazy mm achievement, which is to craft no more than 100, 111 items by hand. You can do these separately in multiple games, but I'm trying to do it all in one game. So let's go ahead and load up. Hit single player, new game. We're gonna hit free play. It's the only way to get achievements. Hit next. We're choosing the map C to seven, typed in eight times. Resources, everything maxed out. All the way to the right. Resources are terrain. We're going to show you preview water is off, clips is off. And because of this map terrain being more desert, we had to make the moisture, the bias, all the way to the right. An enemy, we're making start an area at 300%. Pollution factor is at zero. So they don't, uh, how fast they evolve. Advanced, we're going to make it 900 by 900 for height, width, and height. So the map will never span, so we won't have any enemies off the screen that we can't see. Uh, we're making research on always, so we have all our research items queued up that we can't six at a time. Pollution, we keep it on, and we're making diffusion ratio at zero, so it doesn't go into other chunks. All right, hit play. Hit tab to avoid a cutscene. Alt to see what you're doing. Just hit control, left click as you run past the resources. Try to avoid hitting the fire because it hurts. Alright, we're gonna run up here. Now this says 37 stone expected and 37 coal. Your results will vary. Yeah, but that was 24 and 47. If you want, grab some trees along the way. Doesn't hurt. It's up to you. So there's three of these right off the bat of the rocks. We're going over here to this one. All right, I want to go up real quick. I think it's faster to go up because I forget about it. Now it's up to you to go back to your resource patch to start putting stuff miners down or to go ahead and get the uh, the resources up here. Totally up to you. Regardless one way or the other, I tend to run back to my start area to get uh, iron ore to get a second iron, uh, a second miner going. There's one way over here. On the copper, and there's two more to the left of this down below. I think there's two. I know of one at least. Without having the construction planner to see what's in the area, it's hard. I think oh maybe just be two, one there and one here. That's what it is. All right, with that we're gonna run down. We're gonna get this going. So unfortunately, I didn't show you all my mats. Going. So I would do with slow baton, like I said. You will just do it as you are getting them. But hopefully this will show you most of my resources. Oh, stop doing that one. Let's be a wooden box. And we'll get more as we unlock it. Uh, we'll do power plants for running away. So we're going to craft, put a miner down. Once again, it's in this blue. All the way down. You see these two, because we need to put it like here. So you'll see that to keep it lined up, we need to put it all the way down and one away to the left. And then put a miner, a uh, furnace. And then basically this will go up all the way, this will go down all the way. And you'll see when you do that, if you hover over it, you always see coal. Same thing with these, let's just show you. They're not actually built yet. All right, and put coal in these two. We need 50 for each one. That's why I said I'm going to get it started. We're going to run away. 
We're going to run to the left to get these resources. Then I run to the base. So it's either run down, get it going, and run up and get the other one, and come back or come over here. It's always... Like, running down... I don't know. The run's longer the other way. But you're guaranteed to have more metal to get going. But we only need a total, I think, nine. We already have eight. So it's like that far apart. We don't need this one of stone. There's only two here. Because in order to build another one. Uh, yeah. It's not much. We can build two. We're only building one. And we're going to build one stone furnace afterwards. Now, keep in mind, I did have a craft here to make a stone furnace. We're going to make it one away with the miner on the copper. Facing the same way to the right. And then we'll get these. So when we come back, we have resources we want to fill it back up. Alright, we're going to run straight down now. So we hit the tree line. And then it should be some... Right there it is. Did we see it? There's four. There's one big one by itself here. And there's three more over here. That's five minute mark, apparently. That was pretty good. I think that's a good indication that five minute mark here. You're down here getting these resources. All right, we're running all the way to this copper patch. A little bit out of the way, but it lines us up for the uh, so the other one. There's nothing here. If I had my D construction planner, if I had blueprint to unlock, I'd be able to show you that. But there's nothing over here either. I mean, they're just stone. They're not. There's no coal in them. I'm looking for coal. So I'll have to mine it. It's much faster to do this than it is to mine coal. Until we get a miner on it. But we don't... With the lazy aim achievement, we cannot craft any more than we just did. If you're not going for that, craft as many miners as you can. All right, we're running between the trees. If I did this right. Until we see the, the stone, which is right there on the map. It's right there. Is the first one. I kind of showed you in a setup video, but just in case you didn't watch or read, or I didn't actually, I just showed you I didn't actually do it. So you actually see the run. And there's to the right of the coal here is one. And there's four more inside. Four times 30 is 120, roughly. Because remember, it's approximate, it doesn't give you the exact number, so. Really? Can't reach? That's number one. Here's number two right by it. And number three and four is right below. And here's number four. And if you hover over on the way out, you see the rest of your stone. <clears throat> if you want more stone, by all means. But we don't need it right now. Because playing next to our Start starting base, you know, by our ship. If you see fishies near the water, go ahead and grab them. They're at health. You don't need it in this first part because the, the enemy shouldn't really be attacking you. But I always do it just as a safety measure. Because later on, all the fish should be out in the middle of the pond and you can't get It's hard to grab, grab them. We're running back to our miners. Over here. Grab the resources. Okay. This should be good now. Uh, let's set up what we need for our power plant, which I should have been doing as I was running back, but I always forget. This will be green when I get it, and one of my, this one might turn to steel. Alright. So, to make... A resource we need one lab 
You're gonna need one power pole, but it gives you two. Could actually, we need two, but it's one craft. And then we need one pump, one boiler, which uses a stone furnace. So if you craft an extra stone furnace, I'll pick it up before you craft it. And then we need one steam engine, so apparently we need more metal. There we go. And then we need ten automated science. By looking at that, we need more iron. No big deal. This is why I said about getting that going first, you would have a lot more metal, because this will stack up to 100. I don't even have five yet. Ugh. Really? That's five. Right click to give you a stack. This is where I think coming back to get this going and then running up would give you a lot more in here, but you have that run down and then back up. I think it's better to do this than down. And maybe you do LBs and then come back. I don't know. I'm trying to get another five before I go over there. I don't have to, but it's just easier. So I'm not running back. If you don't want to waste time, Go. you should go get it going. Which I'll show you in a second where we go for it. There we go. Do another clap. But while it's crafting, go over. We're going to put a power pump. That's a 10 minute mark, I believe. Yep. Um, on the water here, the one's by itself. We'll do the boiler. We only have one, but we're just going to hit Q then. And we're going to have a total of three. And then steam engine. Right below that, hit Q, leave a space for a pipe. These will go straight across. And then this will go there. Now, I know speedrunners do this and put pipes, but it's funny or funky when you do power poles. So I always put it here. And then basically the pipes will go between like so. All right, so we know we need to put a power pole between here to get a power down here. Now to show here, we're gonna put a box here and I would like to use electric miners. You see that they'll drop it. Don't, as long as you don't put a insert transport belt there, because it won't put it there if, if there's a ghost there. Leave it, leave it blank ground. And then we need to put a power pole between here to give this power. And eventually another one will go here, but we don't want that as a craft yet. All right, put your science to the far right as you can within that power grid. And once again, we're going to do Animation first, then hit the train, which is down here, and we're gonna go logistics next, then green science, then steel, then engine because we don't need logistics too really. And then we get the engine start to crack. We need 20 of them for the locomotive, and then the logistics too, and then railway. And you see railway unlocks the train, the train track, and yeah. Uh, the cargo wagon. We don't need to craft the cargo wagon or place it, but in order to place the locomotive, it's not only craft the locomotive, you have to place it. In order to place it, it has to be placed on train tracks, and so we need at least three train tracks to be placed. Guess how long it is. So, keep that in mind. This is all set now. You see, we, that's why we did 10. We need 10 for this building, and then 20, and then a lot more as you go up here. Let it go. So, so all ten of those in, and then give this a stack of coal for power. All right. Now, as it's doing that, let's go ahead and uh, chop down some trees. The other thing we need to do, eventually, it's going to be on our way, is remove this ship. If we didn't pick up your ammo, you'll get it now. You won't lose it. We're chopping down trees, and why? I do this. Can you see in here? Where our, you see our trunk, we're polluting. It's only going to stay here. All these trees will eventually will die. Right now they're worth four. Later on they might be worth two. When they're dead, defeated, whatever you want to call it. Their trees were crying out loud, you know. <sighs> we're just kind of wasting time while we, we watch the animation tick away. We know we put all ten in. We don't have to worry about running back and forth. When it's about done, though, we will run back over and uh, grab some more of our metal mats. Because you see right now we have no iron plates in our inventory. And we're going to need 
I think it's like 40 of them in inventory to craft the all the stuff you need to craft the uh, MK1 building. That's what the assembler machine's called. Almost done, so we're gonna run really quickly. Because I didn't realize it was that quick. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Alright. And then uh, that being done, we can craft our building. As it's doing that, we'll run back. Now we did pretty good. We're, we're pretty good with uh, chopping down trees, but if you wanted something to do while you're doing this, this should be done by now. Place your building also here in the power. Alright, we're going to craft someone in boxes real quick. I just wait. We only need like 10. Later on, you might, oh, we might need 20 total, but 10 is fine to start off with. They're not hard to make. Alright, and then we need power poles, but in order for power poles, we need copper cables. So pick the intermediate and pick copper cable. Now this one, I'll have to fill it up a little bit, so I will chop down some more trees. Because then we need trees. If you have more enough, grab some fish. Uh, cause remember, we need trees for wooden boxes as well as power poles. Show you all it's used for. But early game, what is your friend? You, you know, yeah. Well, you can obviously use wood to uh, for powering up um, anything that's burner, like the drills, the um, boiler over there for our power plant. I think coal's more efficient than wood, though. There's like one. I ah, may start. That should be good. Oh yeah. And then we're gonna hit. Uh, make some power poles. <clears throat> I'll just wait. No matter what you sit. No matter how much I craft now. Whether it's twenty. I'd say minimum twenty. You're gonna need 50. You're gonna need 100 and something. Probably, probably done. I never actually figured out how many we needed. But I don't craft the album because you see it's two at a time, so it goes up pretty quick. I usually do 50, then I know I need at least 10 or 20 more. But it's using wood and a copper cable, so it's totally up to you. And then 50 is a max stack, so that's good to know. All right, grab your lab and your um, assembler. Grab the power pole. We're gonna grab it. We're gonna drag it all the way across here. The first indication you're about to write about the right spot is right here where copper and coal meet, and the next one should end right before uh, the iron, which it did. It's one tile away. You see the the little chunky the the copper. Yeah, so you know you're good. I'm good. I know the right spot. All right, let's grab some more of these resources up here. Control left click to take it all out. Alright, so with this all the way over here, we're going to place this first building right here. It's going to line up the bottom of it. It's going to line up with the power pole. We're going to make some uh, iron gears. And what's going to happen, we're going to take, that's where you use ghosting. And it's going to go into a wooden box. If I didn't put that there, if I didn't have it, I just wouldn't put the box there. So it would pick it up. If it has a ghost of a box, it won't pick it up. And then we're going to have another building here in the same alignment. And then this is going to output from the middle to a lab, but go one over to the left. And then this would be Q going up. I'm not going to do the whole thing. And this would be one away going all the way up. And these will go between. I, I like building in the middle, but. Remember, these aren't real. And then these two would be like this. It says we're ghosting. This will run up. You run down. Which one could probably come from over this way, but I'm pretty sure it's there, but... Alright. So, those are done. Remember, we have to hand seed this. And we're not researching while we're doing this, so... Grab those out. Right. Are we able to craft... We will tell... How many buildings? It says none. Oh, we need... We probably overcrafted on the uh, circuits there. So let's grab these. It says two. Eh, really? Only two? 
So we're gonna craft two real quick. Oh, we need to craft grand circuits first. So let's do that. Which uses metal. Thinking we need Yeah, nine. So I'm making sure I have at least nine before I walk back over there. So I know I have one extra craft. Is this done? Yes. Then pick the building. How do I go from nine to oh? All right, we have one building. Wow. This is where it's beginning here. This is where we're having another one. Or sometimes it's better. It wasn't for needing this to do the initial. I would just have them both on metal. But we need this now for everything else we need. For buildings, for inserters, we need copper so we can't really take it off. And we can't do another craft, we would be over. Okay, nine's good. Should give us one more building. There we go. Alright, so this would be gears now. This would be red science. Like so. I'll show you eventually what we're going to end up doing is we'll have these with a miner. I'm lining this up straight up with this because it'll help us line it later. And then these will have an out, obviously. These will be fed into there. So they're going to need a power pole right at the edges. These would be coal fed. So that's good. So let's give this more metal. Let's give this whatever we can. And then this will have a power pole here. Let's go ahead and do that so the science lab has power. So we don't forget to have it have it to have power. Alright. So this is where your, your beginning games, how much metal do you have to be making everything? For example, I know a building takes two, eight, a nine, so 18 after it has the gears and take those out and start putting them in if we get ahead we can make another building if this ain't making it I mean we're gonna need gears regardless right building takes five gears so you might as well make gears <laughs> Otherwise, doing that, let's go ahead and uh, grab more resources. Make sure you always take these out and put it in because we don't have inserters here yet. And then take these out and put them in. Trying to keep some. Cut only five, right? I'm always gonna overspend on. Don't mean to take it out. All right, so we're gonna put a building over here somewhere on the metal. I. I can never remember whether it's up or down. I know this one is here. So this will be... Because there's always one away. Take that one back and keep it there. Because these will have power poles between. And um, these will have... That's how you know the top one should at least go in. So it maybe it goes into the top. So that would be easy to remember it too. I don't know what, how I got a second one. Oh, I didn't place it down. Because I want this to be making... It'll be circuits and this will be gears, but... But for now, we need, we need to do a bunch of other stuff. Since we didn't cra couldn't craft a whole bunch. And this is where... <clears throat> you have tons of metal. We're good now. I, I, I can let it go for the moment. Now just worry about up here. And it doesn't matter where I put it. 
But we're gonna make the circuits. We only got two. And it says we're out of power. Reason being, we're gonna do this and this eventually. I'm used to a feed. So we're gonna need a power pole here. Now eventually too, this will be reverse. And it'll be the same thing. So power pole will go here and then see they all got power. So you don't, you don't need it there. It'll be between afterwards. All right, that's done. Make some green circuits. So now it's whether you make burner miners first or make more buildings. This will need gear anyways. We don't have any. Really? That's all you made? Alright, while well, I'm waiting for this to do, you might as well go ahead and make some uh, stone furnaces. Remember, it takes 5 per, so this 50 sack only makes 10. So when I get that 10, see it's going to stop because it ran out. Go ahead and do it. Oh, we'll oh, stack up. I think 100, if not, if not it's 50. So what I'm going to do really quickly while I'm seeing it. Let's give these all furnaces so I know. Because that reminds us to feed this, take it out, take that, feed that, and put those in. Because if not, I'll rem at least put... We don't want to do both, at least do one of them on each side. I just do it so I know. Cause we need these for, 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 uh, for uh, miners. But if I don't do that, I'll always forget to do it. Alright, metal. We're just getting our stack going. Because each uh, one of them needs uh, one, so. I'll make 10, so we can make 10 if you have the other resources. Yeah. So apparently make metal, or gears. Which is not a lot. Alright, let's see, can we make a miner now? We're off by 2. As soon as we make one, woohoo! We can place one right there. Give them both coal. Now we just doubled our our mining output, and that needs that up all the way. I'm gonna make one more, which is good. And then we'll make this gear for the moment, and we'll put this one here that that starts making more metal we just tripled our technically use a double but three we have we we're making three times I know I need gear for the buildings or inserters so it doesn't matter what I want to do I think your best bet off from the get-go if you can is make all the miners you can. Then I always do this to change, because I, I just remembered. Oh, I don't need to do it. I, I forgot, I, I already placed them down. Like, if you need to place them down, Take them back so you can place the <clears throat> furnaces back down. Apparently we need gears again. This is why it's frustrating. You need more more in building to do it. It's up to you. We have that. 
We possibly could make another building. Let it burn out of all that. Okay, let's make a building. Grab some more metal. There's nine. Because this would be this, so this would be inserters or buildings, and this would be gears. So for now, actually, I'm probably gonna make inserters first. Why is not to sit here and babysit all this? So this will go there, this will go there, to there. I'll make sure we have all these going that we can. Must have been a cap of 27 or something because I wasn't putting metal in. Yeah, okay, eventually I need to do that. So if I bring this metal, we'll do it automatically. Oh, look at that. I don't know why it had to come down. That can do it, so how far are we behind? Alright. Let's <clears throat> be good on that, so we need more, we need more buildings now. We need two more, then we're going to make a bunch of miners. Alright. That's being weird. Let's go ahead and make some miners. Okay, it's not that. I don't have any coal. And I know my power plant's going to run out pretty soon. Oh, it put it in there, that's why. So let's put some coal over here. We know the trick about putting them together. We don't have any coal. I have to mine by hand. Put one on each, each one by hitting Z. Let that run for now for a bit. Two more. The 
it wants to be a with that stack. Right, we're gonna get a hundred back down over here. So I know this is being fed. Ooh, just like that, five. And I don't have to mine, I can just take it out of here now. Go Z on the ones I see red on that I need to make sure they're producing what I need them to produce. Alright, so this one's obvious. So we need more buildings. Fair enough, we'll put that back on a miner now. Stone furnaces. If I have another one, I'll do this. Somewhere out of the way. I'm gonna put two in there. And the rest can go on this box. Feed it furnaces. Or stone to make furnaces, so it can make I think it should be working now. Going Z basically I'm just going around. Cause I don't have enough to give each one a full stack. So just to make sure everything has coal. So one one. And as for now, I'm gonna run over here. Cause I can guarantee this power plant's about out. Look at that. Not that I would have thought about it. I would have uh made sure I had uh Inserters with me, but I know we're low. So, put one here and here. We'll give that a max, a full stack. And for now, I'll get the miner going to start pushing in the, the furnace, and then we'll give it coal here in a minute. To actually start making it into copper plates. Eventually what I need to do is like do this. So if I mess up like that again, they're all being fed. And then really what I should do. I'm gonna do that if I, I can't go all the way across. I can do that at least. Oh I could go one more. And then this will go this way up. Then we have to get inserters eventually, if we ever make them. Six by five, so that's good.
We're almost done with this, so. I need a whole bunch more, I know. We need a whole bunch more on the other side, too. But coals are our biggest issue right now. We do this. Oh. Up this way. Up this way. Up. For now, I'll leave those two up and just do this. And give all those at least one so they work. And time to get done. Hey, it's probably almost done. I am hitting control. Just doing pairs to get it going. Oop. I didn't want to put coal in there. Here we go. So down to the right, up to the left, right, left. Right, up, left. I right, all these should be working now. Oh, these don't even take green gears. To that side, take them out. I think these have a. I don't know how many I got, but apparently that, that there's a max stack. I mean, I could be doing then. Making those inserters then. <clears throat> and we'll, for now, temporary inserter with the box. Really? The run on green circuits are ready. All right. Only oh, ran out of gears. All right. This is not working, so we gotta see where it messed up. Here, up to the right, up to the left, up, up. This is facing up instead of right. There it goes. It's all fixed now. So I'm more than happy to steal the stuff. And then... Oh, do we, oh, we didn't bring in... Uh, I can't tell if that one's real or not. It's probably real, but it fills a note, but fills the same regardless. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I right, change that back to green. And all of a sudden, I have like 21 of them. Which is fine. And then four here. And then on a second one, make five. And believe it or not, this will be just that. We have two buildings now. This is gears. This is uh, belts. There we go. Yeah, I'll take half of these. Five. We're going to put them here. Uh, 
Uh, might not be enough for the whole thing. But I'm not going to about those yet. Oh, maybe just give a few. We'll get these ones going too. Free metal. This is working sweet. That's all set. That's all set. This is. Why is this not working? Oh, is this out of copper? These should have copper in them. Stupid mistake again. I make mistakes. It's just it's funny if you're following it though, like, oh I do this and this, oh I forgot to do that. But it's time to tell you that you, you there is a little bit forgive. That it matters on that one. Let's go there. I sh no matter what I say, I should be good at that. We're changing this back to inserters before we get too screwed. If I was taking these and my building back, oh, that can go there. Yes. <clears throat> if I forget again. Make sure these have inserters. Alright, apparently we need to steal some more coal. Even though it's almost on green. Science research. Let's do that. Get a cap. For now, we're making these pipes. These will be gears eventually. Uh, this is going to come down. Just trust me on this for now. That should be enough. Alright, so we need to change this. We need to make two boilers. So that means we get uh, give it I'm only gonna give it two, two furnaces, and then half a stack there. And then this one needs to be. We need two steam engines. I get the rest. I don't know. No matter what I say, I'm, I'm gonna be off by something. What am I off by? Gears. And look, because I did that, it's already backed up. Nice. It's not the full thing, obviously. Uh, there. Then we're going to change this. Get rid of these two. Get rid of that. We're going to put these across. So you see what we're doing, right? We're getting ready for. Uh, Steel here in a second, but we should be getting green going. But we have until that's done. I'm gonna let go. We're out of coal. So I'll let those go. We've grabbed some more coal, and we've about the halfway mark, 
I feel a little bit more. I'm happy. Everything is set. It's just actually making the the science buildings. All right, let's get these. There, these will stack to 100 when it's when it's done. As long as it has coal in it, it'll put all this in here. It won't put it in there until it ha is able to put still. I came and put it in there manually because it, it doesn't know the recipe yet. All right, so this is good. This is good. We'll do this here in a second. We'll save it. Uh, this, we're, we're a little more than halfway, actually. So this has been the Rotten Raven. Uh, we're going to save it, actually, because I messed up before. I overcrafted. So we're going to call this whatever you want to call it. I don't know. It's like... I don't want to say get on track. This is, let's say, uh, getting on track like a pro. And we're going to say, uh, what is this called? Part one. Because this is part one, and we'll do part two in a bit. So, part one, <laughs> even though that's not high. Alright, this is the Rotten Raven. Thanks for watching.